So you can probably imagine that with a YouTube of about 20,000 plus subscribers, subscribe please, and a Twitter with about 4,000 followers, follow please, and also with my Telegram chats, which are combined, I think about 3,000 people, that I get a lot of emails, a lot of emails. I get a lot of messages, right? Um, a lot of people are continuously shilling me projects and it can get a little bit dizzying because you continually just send information. There's a lot of docs to read through. It can be quite draining, right? I, I love DeFi, so I do enjoy reading about these projects. There's a lot of crap, right? But sometimes something just comes across my desk which makes you stop and think, whoa, really? So this is one of these projects. I haven't seen many people talking about it. And one question you need to ask yourself is, is it going to have a pre-sale? Oh, yeah. That's right. And here we are. So before I start talking about the protocol, which actually, you could call it a tomb fork, but it's not a tomb fork because it's completely different. It's innovated way beyond what has been achieved with a Senior Ridge so far that I've seen. Um, and it takes a lot of the, the work out of Senior Ridge and the understanding, which is a big problem that I've seen many tomb and tomb forks have that a lot of people just don't get it, right? A lot of people when they're dealing with DeFi, they want to press something and then at the end of it, they want to receive the profit. They want the smart contracts to do the work because, you know, they're supposed to be smart. And this is actually promising to do just that with an algorithmically pegged token that is not being unpegged and unpegged through investment, through investor sentiment, it's actually been algorithmically controlled by a, by a smart contract, which is great. Also has a bonding mechanism, which is similar to Olympus DAO or um, any kind of own fork, which is great. And it does also have rewards in blue chip tokens, not just in their own tokens, which is also fantastic. So we're gonna have a look through everything to do with this platform. But before that, yeah, presale, what, what do we have to do for the presale? I'm already prepared. Um, I bought the tokens before I made the video because I'm smart like that. <laughs> I'm gonna show you what kind of tokens you need for this, how many tokens you have from what's sitting on the, the side at the moment. This might change. I advise you to get into their telegrams and get into their Twitter to get the up-to-date news on this. I'm looking at about March, um, April 6th, for the launch or the pre-sale of this when it's beginning, I think from what I can find, popping quickly over to their Twitter, we do have a tweet that they followed up from Tomb Forks, even though Tomb Fork Watch, even though this isn't a Tomb Fork, kind of, well, I don't think it is. I think it's a unique platform, um, saying public launch April 6th. So then coming into Dexpad, which this is their site, by the way, um, dexfinance.com. So Dexpad is their own launch pad. And this has their upcoming projects, which will be US DEX, which will be their PEG token, and DEX Share, which will be their share token, both up for grabs in their pre-sales. And it's saying that to be able to get allocations, you need to hold their token, which is actually has been out for a while, a couple of months actually, and it's called DEX IRA, as we can see here on CoinGecko. We type in DEX IRA, we'll find it right here. So this was the first token they released. They've, they're actually KYC'd and audited with this token, which is great. And because they're also going to get, like they're going to use that KYC for the new DAP and they're going to get the new DAP audited as well. So that's fantastic. It's all above board. This is the token here, DEX IRA, right? Uh, currently worth just a tenth of a cent, right? Coming up to two tenths of a cent. This is a reflection token. As you can see in the 180 days, it launched around about October actually. And it's having a nice little rally right now because it does have a use case because it is now the token of the pad. So if you want to be tier one in the pre-sale for these two tokens, I guess they're going to do one in the next one. I'm not sure. We need to research that more. US DEX will look at. You need to hold 500,000 of this token. If you want to be tier two, you need to hold a million of this token. Doing the maths quickly, we want to hold 500,000. We're going to be just under $1,000 to get a pre-sale all allocation. Uh, what I did was I went and grabbed a million of these tokens, as you can see here, have over 1 million of the DEX token. It is a reflection token as well, gives you a huge reflection um, of like 20% reflection or something. There's a th no tax on purchasing this, but there's a 30% sales tax on it, which is pretty hefty. Uh, quite a cool idea. 
The DEX finance, um, some of it has actually already been KYC'd and audited by um, DEXERA, right? So some has been audited, um, some of it has not yet been audited, but the team has already been KYC'd inside of a, like we can see here, not for this current project, but for their older projects, they've been uh, KYC'd by SolidProof. So that's really cool that they, they've named themselves, they are doxed, okay? The team consists of software engineers, marketing professionals, trading experts, and legal personnel. Their core members even own and operate a full stack media company that provides services, including everything from web development to media production and digital marketing. So that's cool. That's one thing to check off. But this is the overall platform that we're gonna be looking at. I just thought I'd show you the pre-sale information first because I know that's what you guys like. Essentially, this works like Tomb, but there is no automatic idea of boardroom and there's no bonding token. So there's no T-bond, for example. So the peg shouldn't be lost. The algorithm controls the peg through how much profit you take through an auto compound function that it uses. When you go into this, you will choose how much you want to compound and how much you want to profit take from the end of each cycle that it will run then you take your profit like you would and it auto compounds back into the pro protocol yeah which also helps to maintain the peg of the peg token which is pegged to a dollar very smart okay takes out the human error because a lot of the time we get greedy when things are going really well and we tank the project or sometimes when something slips just below peg we all panic and then lose this peg completely so very smart here we're gonna have a look through the docs so I can explain it in one easy to look at chart. What is the difference? Why, how is this different to Tomb, right? Money Market operates a three token system designed to work in harmony with another. Our protocol uses advanced tokenomics to accomplish three objectives. Maintain the price of PEG, very important. Dex Finance uses only one regulation staking pool. In the system, the price of the PEG token is regulated by smart contracts, not by us, not by investors. The protocol's underlying mechanism dynamically buys and sells the supply of the PEG token, US DEX, pushing its price up or down relative to the price of USDC. Allow less experienced investors to participate in high yield farming. Experienced investors eat, sleep, and breathe crypto. They spend countless hours charting trends and plotting complex trades that can flip the market for beginner and part-time investors in an instant. Which is a problem because then we can easily get dumped on by these crypto maniacs, degen geniuses, yeah, like yourself, yes. <laughs> to help level the playing field for new and less experienced crypto investors, we have created a new ecosystem that empowers users by simplifying the advanced trading strategies employed by experienced investors and promotes growth through a low risk algorithmic trading model. Prevent mercenary yield farmers from pillaging liquidity pools. Today's latest DeFi projects offer more incentive than ever. Investors can often earn massive returns during the project's infancy as token creators dangle ultra-high yield carrots in front of newcomers. While this can spur a hefty spike in the project's total value locked in the very first days of it launching, as soon as the reward scheme ends, these mercenary farmers will leave and then go somewhere else, yeah, tanking the price of the token, and then therefore of its seniorage, the the peg will fall under. These three tokens we're looking at. US DEX. US DEX token is designed to be used as a medium of exchange. The built-in stability me mechanism in the protocol aims to maintain US DEX's peg to one US dollar coin. DEX share, this would be, I guess, the equivalent of T-share. DEX shares are one of the ways to measure the value of the money markets protocol and shareholder trust in its ability to maintain US DEX close to peg. DEX shareholders have voting rights of governance on proposals to improve the protocol and future cases within the money market protocol. DEX ETF. DEX ETF token represents the average value, cumulative value of basket selected cryptocurrencies and is used to reduce sell pressure on US DEX. Good. During epoch expansions, the protocol mints US DEX, which and then which is then collected and converted into DEX ETF tokens prior to being redistributed proportionally to all DEX shareholders who have staked their tokens in the regulation pool. So by staking your DEX share token that you receive, you will then get DEX ETF token rewarded to you. As I said, it does also have a bonding system where you can purchase the US DEX and the DEX share um, and then it will be vested to you over time. You can redeem them after over a certain amount of time. 
So the expansion of the protocol is also based on the TWAP, okay, but it's the TWAP of US DEX. So on Tomb, the TWAP is 1.01. At the beginning of every epoch, if the TWAP of US DEX is greater yeah, than 1.01, new US DEX will be minted at a maximum of 4.5% expansion. However, rather being immediately distributed to regulation pool stakers, the new supply of US DEX is sent to a smart contract where it is sold based upon specific parameters and only after calculating such factors as price, circulating supply, and treasury-backed assets. As the US DEX is sold off, it is then converted into our DEX EFT token, ETF token, I think, um, and redistributed back to the regulation pool stakers, thereby relieving sell pressure. Nice little system. There's a smart contract. It's nothing to do with investors dealing with the, the, the peg of the token. This is solving the problem of the bond token, such as T-Bond. Uh, in, in the traditional model, when the price of the PEG token falls below PEG, bonds are issued to help incentivize buy pressure. These bonds can then be redeemed for more PEG tokens when the price is above. But a lot of the time, people don't know what to do with these bonds. Uh, a lot of people don't use them. A lot of people just sell the PEG token and panic. And this eliminates the problem of using aforementioned method of regulation and protects the investors from losses in the process. Because sometimes also the bonds just never get, the, the peg price never re recovers and we just are left with bonds, which are useless. So here's some strategies, right? Um, Dex Finance enables users to stake their tokens within a multi-step strategy rather than manually having to adjust the emission rates and market fluctuations. So what you can do with this platform, which is why I think it's going to be really popular, is, for example, we zap in here, right? Zap means you put in one token, it'll give you liquidity immediately, right? Then it will go to your peg farm. Then it will automatically go to the deck share rewards, being paid out deck share token from your staking in the peg farm. That will then zap straight into the share farm, which will then give you rewards in deck share, more deck share, right? Then that will automatically go into the regulation staking, which will give you uh, US DEX rewards. will automatically sell some of the US DEX into ETF token. The EFT, the ETF rewards will be either DEX, US DEX, DEX share, DOT, MATIC, Cardano, BNB, XRP, or ETH. Users set take profit levels and get paid in the ETF token. So it means we're not actually getting paid wholly in this PEG token, we're getting paid in another token, but that token has value and will give you rewards and all these other tokens. Then the remaining rewards of our compounding uh, amounts that we've set, because we can choose how much we want to compound automatically, will be sent back into the farm to create more and more compound interest straight for us. Very nice. Then the strategies that we choose are based on risk, right? We could be very conservative with our staking strategy that we can choose. We could just click on one and be like, I want to do this one. I want to be conservative. I'm going to zap in there. I want to be uh, risk tolerant. I'm going to zap in here. I want to be balls to the wall, gunslinger. I'm going to zap into the most dangerous one and see if it's going to make me uh, rich or wrecked, right? So that is the, the great thing here as well. You can just zap them straight in. Fantastic. This is what the DAP is going to look like once launched. You know, we could connect the wallet right here to MetaMask and it will show you the prices of the four tokens. So we do have DEX IRA, the token we're going to have to hold for the launchpad, US DEX, DEX Share, DEX ETF, where we can buy and sell them straight from the site. This is where we would find strategies. This is where we would find farms. So the strategy is pretty interesting. The ones down here, where we just click in. Done, right? Zap straight into a strategy. That's why I think this is going to be taking off. It's so easy, so straightforward. And people like that. You know, I like that. And then deep, then after you've got into it and you start feeling around the platform, then you can start getting into more advanced strategies because this goes pretty deep. Very deep platform, well, very well thought out, solid team, audited, coming up with pre-sale, ticking all the boxes for me. I've been Crypto Mischief. You've been fantastic. Don't get ready. Tell me, tell me how you do it